Ladies and gentlemen, it is your boy, A.A. Ron, and I swear, if I have to deal with another power outage, I'm going to literally flip! But anyway, we're going to do a Chateau Malbec. It's a Bordeaux. Apparently got a uh, 90 points on, what is this, wine enthusiast? Yes. Never heard of a Chateau Malbec. Is there like an actual like place here? Uh, Bordeaux. App. Appellation of Bordeaux control, 14%. Gironde. Yeah, I'll take a word for it. <laughs> so, yes, I lost power again last night. This seems to happen a lot this week, and I don't like it. I care not for sitting in the lack of AC of my bedroom at night when I'm trying to sleep, and I can't because it's too hot. And uncomfortable. And disgusting. And I hate it. I do. I hate it. So. I never finished the rosé that we tried last night. Or I did, anyway. Not sure if I actually can. Because to be quite honest, when you have a wine that you open and then something bad happens, it leaves a bad taste in your mouth. Not so much the wine, but the experience of the wine, you know? Because I did. I had our video last night. I was going to sit down to a lovely dinner and drink the entire rest of the bottle that I used with my food and cooking. And no, the power went poof. Well, actually, it did some flickering. Then it went poof. So, yeah. Needless to say, I'm infuriated. I am. I don't like my power company anymore. They make me angry. Power goes out again tonight. I don't know what I'm going to do. I am probably going to just have to do something completely irrationally insane that will get me in the news for all the wrong reasons. And we don't want to do that. We don't. We don't want me to have to do that. We don't. So, if the power could stay on tonight and throughout the entire weekend, that would be most dashing. Hmm. Not really. There's like a maybe a slight hint of a pepper, black pepper. I feel like. Oh, what is this? like right on the tip of my tongue or actually my nose and I can't just get it. let's try the taste let's see if I can figure it out from the taste Whoa, quite high tannin, medium acidity. Holy cow, that is dry. Let me see if there's something on the back here. You tell me. No, there's nothing there. Oh my gosh. Like, I'm not sure if it's like a... Guys, I'm really sorry. I can't, like, figure this out. I really can't. I got nothing on this. For some reason, I feel like there's some kind of vanilla and dark chocolate. Somehow mixed with kind of, like, a berry. You know how you have, like, the berries that are coated in the chocolate? But it's like dark chocolate and maybe some hint of vanilla. That tannin though is just really hard to get a taste on it. Like I say, it's very high tannin. This will be very good with my steak tonight, but if you are a um, 
just starting out wine drinker, I'm not sure if I recommend this. This might get you off of red wine like that. And it's just my professional opinion. And also my professional opinion, that over there is a junk. Junk is ignoring us. He likes our bone. His bone. Where's Bean? Guys, where's the bean? Left her somewhere. Oh, there she is. Hello. Oh, she's taking her tongue out of us. Oh, of course you are. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe. Oh, and like.